What's up guys, that really gross guy here, and we are back playing Warframe. So, I got some good news, got some good news. Um, I'm going to TennoCon. I purchased tickets yesterday. The one unfortunate thing, Lissette goes underwater? What? Is that a thing? I guess that's a thing. I don't know. Um, I got tickets to TennoCon. Now, I'm really, really excited, don't get me wrong, but... Um, it was a little, little frustrating because I really, really, really wanted to get VIP tickets because, man, I really wanted to meet the devs, really wanted to maybe pick the brains a little bit, talk and do some, you know, I don't know, just see the studio, uh, the, the, the developer studio. And, man, I was super hyped to do that. But, man, tickets for the VIP access sold so fast. I mean... Wow, excuse you. I'm trying to talk to my peeps here, and you just freaking blast me back in the water? Okay. Um, but yeah, it was super disappointing. I feel like like tickets sold out super fast, and I feel like a lot of people that were maybe hoping to get VIP tickets, and I mean a lot of people, um, didn't, didn't get it. I mean, I think tickets sold out within a couple couple hours maybe maybe three hours I don't I don't know because I remember tickets going up sale at least my time uh, and I had to I had to go out I had to make sure I had uh, like uh, like like the past like getting in and out of the country stuff situations appropriate before I actually decided yes I'm purchasing the ticket and what to you know so I went and did that and by the time I got back by the time I just went off to uh, the, the DMV and uh, got you know a little bit of stuff situated tickets were sold out within within hours definitely within hours it was uh, when I heard that tickets sold out uh, for the VIP access in 24 hours last year I was like you know what even if even if uh, the, the, the the demand for the VIP tickets goes up it'll probably only go up or I mean it or you know it'll the the I'll probably still have about 12 hours. I was expecting like 12 hours I should have to get this done. I'm going to go do what I need to do for two, three, four hours, whatever it ended up taking. I think it was only like maybe three hours or so after uh, after I, I, I noticed or I left for the tickets or, you know, when I knew the tickets were going up. Um, and by the time I got back, sold out sold out I was super bummed I mean granted I did I did decide I, I did pick up tickets to go anyways um, but for the most part man I really wanted I really wanted to do the the VIP stuff I was super excited for that but uh, there's always you know there's always next year um, I'll, I'll, I'll do my best maybe next year to secure VIP tickets, maybe, you know, I at least get to meet and shake hands with uh, some of the devs. Uh, that would be awesome. That would be super cool, but super excited to go. I, I, I mean, uh, hear me out. The, the, the hardware or the, the that I'm bringing uh, is not the greatest, but I want to take you guys along and I want to show you guys uh, from my perspective and, and get a little insight of how I'm feeling. I'm going to take my GoPro. Now this GoPro um, isn't one of the fisheye ones, so it's not gonna like make things super distorted. But I want to uh, I want to make a video, even if it's not like uh, entirely. I don't think I'll think I don't think I'll be allowed to legit, like film the whole thing, and I don't even think I have I'll have enough battery life to film the whole thing. Um, obviously, there's going to be all sorts of stuff uh, going up online uh, for you guys. Oh, can I? Scan those? I have never seen those plants. I doubt it. I doubt it. No, it doesn't look like it. Um, but yeah, I want to make a. I want to make a video. I want to make a do a thing. Whoa, is that a just awesome? Uh, of 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 my trip. You know, me uh, me heading out and me uh, me driving, uh, getting um, you know, getting some one on one time, a little bit of a date. No, but you know, having some fun and. Um, I'm going to, I'm going to be close enough to drive 
uh, to Canada because I have family that is not too far from, well, I don't want to, I mean, it's a distance, but I have family that, uh, that I will be leaving from to, to be able to get over there and I won't have to fly by plane. So that will be pretty cool. Um, so that'll be fun. That'll be fun. Uh, we'll talk. We'll do some stuff. Uh, maybe we'll uh, play a little bit of I Spy on the way there. No. Um, what? I'm super confused. Pick up Datum. Okay, that's cool. Let me, just, let me just blast these guys. There you go, Mesa. Have your peacemaker do its work. Okay, no one else in here? Cool. Um, so yeah, we'll have fun with that. We'll have fun with that. Hopefully you guys really enjoy that. Um... And by the time, well, at the time I am recording this this video, I am at 998 subs. So, two more subs, two more of you guys being absolutely awesome is going to put us at a thousand, and that is that is freaking awesome, guys. That is, uh, I'm so excited. I'm so happy. Um, within a short amount of time. Um, I'll be applying for the uh, the fan channel program, and I just I am super excited to start getting involved more with the uh, the community and Warframe, and maybe uh, being able to to bounce ideas off of the de developers, and maybe get to see some stuff. You know, obviously, you know, I need to, as a, as a fan channel, anything that is disclosed between, like, me and DE about future content is most likely going to be, uh, very hush-hush. But for the most part, for the most part, my, my, my idea and my goal of being a fan channel is not about, is not about being, uh, a, a, a min-max build super end game oriented type thing i am totally down for being you know fun and down to earth and just uh you know doing doing content fun content not necessarily you know like i said end game stuff i want to i want to enjoy the game with you guys i want to be able to talk on your behalf when it comes to what you guys are thinking about if you guys are having trouble with stuff in game and um and that's the stuff I, I, I like to hear from you guys. If you guys are struggling with the thing or you feel like like something something could use a tweak or this or that, that's little stuff that I like to hear because I know that uh, that as this game develops, uh, there's a whole lot of there's a whole lot of, uh, of, of checking on older content and whoa look at all those dudes in that room okay let's get a shadow shield and blast them look at that look how sick mesa is oh i love mesa um but yeah so i want i want to be able to represent you guys you know part of the community that um maybe Maybe it's just, I mean, there's a lot of people just that just are scream so loud that, you know, when, when there's negativity and stuff in there, a lot of that stuff is just heard over the stuff that actually needs to be heard. You know, when, uh, when, when people are super negative about a thing and all they do is just say, this is stupid, this is garbage, this is this, this is that, a lot of people, uh, uh, that's that's most of what the developers unfortunately hear and they have to dig for the real good information they have to dig for like for like the fixes you know if you guys were like like oh i feel like like this this warframe is garbage it can't do you know it can't do abilities or i don't know like like maybe it's not as good anymore cuz it's an older frame or something like that and instead of people just saying, oh, this is stupid, this is garbage, this or that, maybe some of you guys, you know, could be like, hey, how about we tweak this ability or we we give a, give this kind of alternate passive type thing or maybe we, we uh, let's say, 
let's say there's an ability that doesn't have enough range to make it useful and you're like maybe if we just tweak its range a little bit or we give it certain benefits to to you know other other variations or add a little bit of a of a altered um, not necessarily an augment because you need you need mod space for augments but but if uh, if you could use just a little tweak to make it you know just right just right uh, that's stuff that the developers like really have to dig to to find out you know find out how people are feeling because like I said you know, so many people are just are just this is dumb this is stupid this is you know you, you you know, and then they, they they resort to, like, death threats and stuff. What is wrong with people these days? But, anyways, um, I don't know. I just think it would be really cool. Really cool to be part of the community and, uh, and, uh, represent, represent the, the, the guys that, that really, really put their heart and soul into the game. Not just, you know, because the, the developers put their heart and soul into the game. But us as players, we put so much time into the game. Um, many of us have have thousands of hours in Warframe. Hundreds of hours is, is a lot. Like, think about hundreds of hours in your life. Hundreds of hours. If you were to work, if you were to work a minimum wage job for a thousand hours, that's that's a lot of cash. That's a lot of cash. Um, so just just imagine putting thousands of hours into a game like this because you love it because you love it um, that's I don't know th those those are the people that deserve that deserve to be heard is the people that are constructive and put their heart and soul into the game and are with it when it's when it's struggling and are with it when it's when it's great you know that's that's awesome and the people that that promote the game not necessarily because they want to get something out of it but people that promote the game because they love it and they want to see it get better, get stronger. Um, that's what, that's, that's, I know that's how a lot of you guys are. I know that's how a lot of the community is. It's just, like I said, there's a lot of loud people out there that like to just be negative. So, um, but yeah, enough, enough, enough of that negativity. Tenocon is going to be awesome. I am super excited to go. I am super excited to reach a thousand. I am super excited to get this channel to the point where where I reach as many people as I can, and I get to make you know this is just just smiles come to your face. Um, in the future, I want to I want to give just as much as I get. You know what I mean? This is super fun. Uh, as this helps me, you know, whether it be financially and helps me do more, more content because it provides for me, I want to reward you guys and thank you guys through giveaways and through other things. And I am, uh, I mean, that might be a little ways off. I've done giveaways in the past just literally because I felt like I should. So more is coming uh, when it comes to that kind of stuff. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. Blow. And blow.